A revolver is a repeating firearm that uses a cylinder that contains multiple chambers and at least one barrel for firing. The revolver for this example is double action, meaning that the hammer is cocked back when pulling the trigger, and once the trigger is pulled all the way back, the hammer is released to hit the firing pin. Let's look at the firing sequence. The trigger lever pushes the hammer backward. As it moves backward, the hammer compresses a metal spring in the handle. The spring showed is a coiled spring. Uncoiled tension springs are also used. At the same time, a pawl attached to the trigger pushes on a ratchet to rotate the cylinder. This positions the next breech chamber in front of the gun barrel. Another pawl lodges in a small depression on the cylinder. This stops the cylinder in a particular position so it is perfectly lined up with the barrel. When the trigger lever is pushed all the way back, it releases the hammer. The compressed spring drives the hammer forward. The firing pin on the hammer extends through the body of the gun and hits the primer. The primer explodes, igniting the propellant. The propellant burns, releasing a large volume of gas, and the gas pressure drives the bullet down the barrel. The gas pressure also causes the cartridge case to expand, temporarily sealing the breech. All the expanding gas pushes forward, rather than backward.